Why is it that Vayne doesn't appear in pro play? At least here, I don't think I've ever seen her. Because she does not win any matchup bot lane. You don't have the pressure that you need in comp play. Because if you pick Vayne, you're pretty much conceding all dragons, which is pretty much a, a death. Is it not possible for her top lane? You can play her top lane in pro play, but if she falls behind, she's f But like, if you play Gangplank and you fall behind, no one gives a f you're still fine. If you play Orin and you fall behind, you're fine. If you play Aatrox and you fall behind, you're still fine. But if you play Vayne and fall behind, you cannot do anything. Because now, if you play Vayne top lane, you have to play top centric and play through heralds which is what teams generally don't want to do unless they're losing if you're losing a game you tend to play top side and pro play but when you're winning a game you tend to play bot side that's how things generally play out i never forget when cast picked vein mid true and because of the one condemn he landed right here the game was okay if he lost that game by the way he would have been a laughing stock for the rest of his life for vein mid that's what everyone were, um, would remember him for but because he landed one condemn and then he turned the entire game, he is not a laughing stock and everyone always brings it up. How it can be played meta mid, which it can be, objectively speaking. Are you actually gonna stand there and auto? Wow. It actually almost worked. That's the crazy part. I'm gonna suicide tower die the hell out of this guy. Oh, he has no W too. I'm tower diving that. I oh, don't give a. F give me some autos too beforehand. Thank you very much. That makes my life easier. Thank you very much. Bloodthirster rush. Yes, we're going bloodthirster rush. And the reason why is we're going Bloodthirster Rush is so that we ha we can get Overheal and Bloodthirster, right? Uh, and the lifesteal from Bloodthirster to protect the Bloodthirster and our absolute focus. That's our idea here. But my question is, is how come they removed the shield from BT? Maybe it's too OP. I guess they didn't like it, but that's fine. Not a big deal. We got Overheal and Revitalize to help out the boys. I see Sasuke has been using his neurons in a wise way lately. True. I think that's a bait. Omega lol. This is Omega lolly. I'm good gank, bro. No more lethal tempo on Vayne? No, I just don't think lethal tempo is the best rune on Vayne. And everyone else, please calm down. Just because I'm not running something, the time that you enter my stream does not mean it's dog shit anymore. For example, if I play Vayne ADC the next game, that doesn't mean Vayne top is dog shit, okay? If I decide to run AP Vayne, that does not mean AD Vayne is dog shit, okay? Calm down. <laughs> okay? <laughs> Calm down, please. <laughs> Just because I don't stream for one day does not mean I'm not streaming the next day. Calm down. Let's keep the BT rolling, huh? So Bloodthirster gives me how much AD? 10 attack damage right now. I do so much damage. Look at this. I have overheal, right? From the, my rune. I have absolute focus, which gives me AD. And I have gathering storm. And then I have BT when I'm above 50% health, gain AD. It's crazy, man. The overheal keeps the absolute focus and BT bonuses alive. The BT allows you to keep the overheal. Oh my god, this is five hedge level of gameplay. Five hedge. Now imagine, guys, if I went Immortal Shield though next. So now if I drop below 30% somehow, I gain a shield. So I can't die. Five hedge, man. Actual. Guys, watch this five head. Wait, I'm gonna hold the cannon here on purpose for a second. Wait, wait, on purpose. Then now the wave is gonna beat around here. And I can... No, never mind. My, my teammates are all from the top side. Oh, Gangplank's still there. Alright, so... <laughs> Goodbye, Gangplank. Get the last hit. Next. I'm a beast. 
Ah, damn, it's looking rough for the enemy team. Who's TPing in? And why are you TPing in? No. <laughs> Guys, I got pink warded. <laughs> Guys, do we go PD or do we go? Gunsu's Rage Blade, be honest, guys. Be honest. Gunsu's or PD? Next build after this, we're going. Uh... I see Rage Blade, I see PD, I see Static. We built Static two games in a row. Let's change up the vibes a little bit. Let's go, um, let's see. Let's go. Let's go PD. We'll go PD. And then let's go Infinity Edge. Is Camille a hard matchup for Vayne? No. I personally think Camille is one of the easiest matchups for Vayne. Have you tried AP Vayne? I have not. Because? Well, I, I did I did earlier today, but the AP ratios don't exist on her W anymore. It, is, it exists on her Q for some reason. So I'm not going it. Oh, this guy's too good, man. This guy's too good. That guy's too good to League of Legends, man. Holy smoke. E. Use E. Use E. See what happens. See what happens. Do it. Do it. Use it. Use it. <laughs> Life has a very simple formula. Let me let me teach you guys, okay? The more you f around, okay, the more you find out. You guys are all Giga Chads. I'm just f joking. You guys are all lonely as. <laughs> you Sasuke? <laughs> oh my lord! Why I E third though? Yo, crit damage, bro. West Coast sucks and the East Coast sleeping. Where do I belong and where's this leading? I don't know where I'm at tonight. Cause my brain's going over dry. I lie.